counsel. You need a sounding board to let me know, all right? Yeah, thanks. I may do. In the meantime, tune up. Yeah, catch you later. Excuse us, I'll have her back in a moment. You can't do this. I'm working. Look, just tell me one thing. Is me being a funeral director a huge problem for your family? Everything about you is a problem. You're not Chinese, we haven't been betrothed since childhood, and you're holding me captive with your demonic powers. Well, why didn't you tell me? I give you something else to obsess about? You're an undertaker, I accept it. I can't change what my mother thinks. Being with you is like being in this huge maze. I'm lost all the time. You gotta stop making me guess everything. All I want to do is make you happy. Yes, I know that. Everything okay? How the hell would I know? Your mate's before me. Oi, nurse, get over here. Suck in it. Oh, I need to go to the toilet. And when am I getting this x ray the doctor was going on about? Oh, I'm still waiting. It won't be much longer. Radiologist has been a bit busy. It's not good enough. Oh, 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 oh. God, I'm sorry. Are you okay? Do I look okay? Oh, what have you done? My back. Oh, oh. Hey, mate, I'm home. Daniel? Uh, only me. Well, have you seen Daniel? Well, not unless he came in and left again while I was in the shower. It's nearly five o'clock. Where is he? Well, maybe he had Daniel. sports or something this afternoon. Well, he didn't mention it. Well, give your mum a call. She'll know a schedule. Oh, no. Why interrupt the holiday? I wouldn't worry. He'll turn up when he gets hungry enough. I always used to. Right. That would be back in the olden days when kids didn't get abducted at the school gate, would it? I'll give you a call on your cell phone if he fronts. Thanks. Ah! Careful! So what happened exactly? She was helping me to the toilet. <laughs> He slipped. I don't know how. OK, let's get you checked out, eh? Can you raise your foot for me? Try to keep your legs straight. No, no, it's too sore. OK, OK, where's the pain? Starts in my lower back and shoots around there. All right, I need to get a tendon hammer to check you out properly. I'll be back in a sec. I think I've going for a slash. Could be hazardous to your health. Pardon? We came in compl complaining of acute back pain, exacerbated by a heavy fall en route to the dunny. That's his story, is it? His name's Sam Littlewood. His specialty's faking an injury, so he can try and get compensation. Ah. Look, I'll just get Mr Young sorted for his transfer, and then I'll deal with him in a minute. You sure? Yeah, leave it to me. I'll enjoy it. Fine. What do you know what time it is? Where have you been? Nowhere. Just at school. Until five o'clock. Doing what at school? Playing rugby. Daniel. Mum said that I can't play for the school. Well, I wasn't. I was just mucking around with the second 15 and it wasn't even a proper practice. It's still rugby. You know Mum's worried about you getting hurt. She's way overprotective and she's not going to know, is she? Unless you tell her. You're making me the meat in the sandwich here. Just be cool. No, sorry, mate. Rugby's out. We can have another go at convincing the olds next year, when you're a bit bigger. This sucks. I'm just seeing Louise. Is everything all right? She's dropped a complaint. Thanks to your efforts, by the look of it. Glad it all worked out. Well, thank you. Believe it or not, Chris, I'm on your side. Is that any better? No, it's too sore. Do you think the doctor will be long? Oh, I don't think he'll be needed, Sam. Do you? I'm 
taking it, you know, Mr. Littlewood. Oh, Sam and I go way back, don't we? So, here's the deal. We'll admit you overnight, run some tests, or rule out any injury from your fall. As soon as the tests are through, you're out of here. Yeah, but the doctor thought Yes, that but Dr. Valentine doesn't know you, whereas you and I have played this little game before, haven't we? Hey, probably these. I guess I got a bit carried away last night. I was a bit upset. I got the message now. You go your way, I'll go mine. Best for both of us. No hard feelings. And we're back with the staff of Shortland Street at the slightly later time of half past 11 on Monday morning here on RTE One. <laughs> 